Are, are you Miss Benson? Yes, I am. You must be Mr. Parker. Right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> come, come in. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> sit down. Let's sit down. Sorry. Okay. I have a girlfriend who tried this computer dating service and it really worked out wonderfully well for her. Yeah? Yes. They met on a Friday and they were married on a Saturday. Mm. Well, this is my first time. Mine too. It was my mother's idea. <laughs> oh. Um, would you care to listen to some records? I don't like music. You don't? No, it gives me vertigo. Well, that's, that's funny. Oh, well, not really. It affected my father the same way. No, no, what I, I mean is it's, it's rather funny that the computer overlooked that. Yeah, that's right. We're supposed to have the same likes and dislikes. Well, you do like to swim. I don't know how. <laughs> how about you? Do you like skydiving? Oh, no. Goodness, you could never even get me up in an airplane. Gee, we don't seem to have anything in common. I wonder why the computer picked our names. Speaking of names, did you know that the commonest surname in the whole wide world is the Chinese name Chang, which is born, according to estimates, by between 9.7 and 12.1% of the Chinese population? No, I didn't. Yeah. Oh, here. Here, these are for you. Oh, they're lovely. <laughs> the oldest fossil of a flowering parent was found in Colorado in 1953, and dated about 65 million years old. <laughs> You're kidding. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> May I take your hat, Mr. Parker? <laughs> oh, call me John. <laughs> John. <laughs> The highest price ever paid for a hat was $29,471. It was worn by Emperor Napoleon on January the 1st, 1815. However, it was purchased by Moéa Chandon, a French champagne house. Gee, that's fantastic, Miss Benson. Call me Helen. <laughs> All right, Helen. <laughs> the longest distance for a champagne cork to fly from an untreated and unheated bottle oh, four feet from level ground oh. is 70 feet three tenths inches oh. it was popped by A.D. Beattie Heaver Kent England July 20th 1971 I'll drink to that <laughs> Gee, your dinner smells delicious. I just love spaghetti. Oh, the largest amount of spaghetti ever consumed by a human being was 262.6 yards. It was eaten by Tom L. Skretsky in Dino's Restaurant in San Diego, May 20th, 1970. Oh, John! Oh, Helen! Oh, John. The longest surviving heart transplant <gasps> is Louis B. Russell, 47, of Indianapolis, Indiana. Oh, go on. Oh, Helen. Oh. Helen, I'm falling for you. Oh, oh a tomcat named Fat Olive survived the fall on grass from a 160-foot high penthouse on July 18th, 1972, and only broke two legs. Oh, John. Oh, I'm getting turned on by you, John. I'm getting your message. Oh, John, the, the longest voyage recorded for a message in a bottle. It was one of 25,000 miles from the Pacific to the shore of the island of Stilt and the North Sea on December 3rd, 1968. Oh, Helen, Helen, marry me, and I promise I'll always be true. Really? In Malaya, Abdul Rahman, age 55, of Kuala Lumpur. Married his 23rd wife in October of 1967, John. But Helen, 
The longest recorded marriage is one of 86 years between Tamil G. Bika G. Nariman and Lady Nariman from 1853 to 1940. Please, can I talk you into marrying me? I'm terribly sorry, John. But I'm afraid that you and I just aren't suited for each other. I... Goodbye, John. Well, I guess I'll have to walk out of your life, never to look back. Honey, El Wingo of Abilene, Texas. Walk backwards a distance of 8,000 miles from Fort Worth, Texas to Istanbul, Turkey. I'm sorry you didn't get to eat any dinner, John. 1,220 cold baked beans were eaten one by one with a cocktail stick in 30 minutes by Clifford Pierce at Jared's Cross, England on December 5th, 1971. I'm sorry, too. Just go! Goodbye, Helen. Oh, Helen. Helen. John. One more kiss. Oh, John. Helen. John. The longest prolonged marathon kiss in the history of the movies was between Jane Wyman and Regis Toomey, 185 seconds, in your In the Army Now, released in 1940, John. Oh. <laughs> Helen, you feel like breaking the world's record. What kind of a record, darling? The greatest number of children ever produced by a married couple was 68 by my parents. My mother gave birth to 16 set of twins. Get out, John. Seven. <laughs> set of triplets. The oldest living virgin is Sheila Levine of New York City, age 108. I think I'm going to beat her record. <laughs>